A terrifying escape as torrents of flood water nearly drown an elderly woman screaming for help. Rescues like this have occurred across China as the now downgraded typhoon Doksuri made its way north, prompting President Xi Jinping to order an all-out rescue effort. We received a call for help at around 4 o'clock in the morning. More than 400 residents were evacuated to safe places. In Beijing and nearby Hebei province and Tianjin, hundreds of thousands of people have been evacuated. The water transforming roads into rivers and ripping bridges apart. Aeroplanes were inundated, while cars and buses were completely swept away. The cars parked on the street floated and got washed away. A couple of cars parked behind my apartment building disappeared in just a minute. Emergency supplies have been flown into isolated communities. The mountainous areas, there were a lot of landslides and flooded villages. I repeatedly cried seeing those reports. Where the water has started to subside, mangled car wrecks have been left behind. A huge clean-up effort is already underway. We have been clearing away the mud and debris for almost a day and a night. But now communities are bracing for more as another typhoon already impacting Japan could hit the Chinese coast later this week. Kathleen Coldwood, ABC News.